Work out the following without using a calculator, giving your answers in standard form. So we've got 4.9 times 10 to the minus 5 divided by 7 times 10 to the 4, and 3 times 10 to the 7 divided by 5 times 10 to the minus 3. Now remember, standard form, this number here must be a number between 1 and 10, and this number here is an integer, positive or negative. So if we take right down the first one, now I like to write these things, but rather than use the division sign, to consider it as a fraction. So it's 4.9 times 10 to the minus 5 over 7 times 10 to the 4. The problem here is we've got to do 4.9 divided by 7. This is a decimal divided by a whole number. But if we write this 4.9 as 49, and remembering that 4.9 times 10 to the minus 5 is actually equal to 0 0.000049, i.e. we would move the decimal point 5 places in order to get to the 4.9, then we'd only need to move it one more place to get 49. So we need to change this to 10 to the minus 6, divided by 7 times 10 to the 4. Now it's very easy to do, because 49 divided by 7, we know is 7. And then we've got times 10. And for the powers, because we're doing a division, we do minus 6 minus 4. That's the rule of indices for, for division of two numbers with the same base. So minus 6 minus 4, and that becomes 7 times 10 to the minus 10. For the second example, we've got 3 times 10 to the 7 divided by 5 times 10 to the minus 3. Remember, the whole idea is to do this without using a calculator. Again, writing it as a fraction, so it's 3 times 10 to the 7 over 5 times 10 to the minus uh, 3. Now you might know that 3 over 5 is 0 0.6 and that's times 10 to the 7 minus minus 3. Be very careful with your minus signs here which gives you 0 0.6 times 10 to the 7 plus 3 which is 0 0.6 times 10 to the 10. Now this is number is actually not in standard form because the conditional standard form as that this number must be a number between 1 inclusive and 10 not inclusive. And 0.6 is less than 1. So if we think what this number means, 0 0.6 to the power of 10 is going to be six, the number uh, 6 billion. Uh, if you think, we move the decimal point 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. However, if we move the decimal point one place that way, this number here will become 6, and we will have to reduce the power of this by 1. So the final answer will be 6 times 10 to the 9. So this has been a video to show you how to do standard form using uh, division without using a calculator. I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.